president has announced that the old 200 naira in the banknotes will remain legal tender for two more months. The move comes after protests over a shortage of cash in the country. Last year, Nigeria's central bank decided to start circulating newly designed notes and the old ones became invalid. But the new notes have been in short supply, leading to long queues and chaotic scenes at banks right across the country. Let's go to live to Lagos, our correspondent in Kechi Gombona, who is there for us. And uh, in Kechi, just tell us a little more about what lies behind uh, what has been a chaotic situation. Matthew, it's been really chaotic here in Nigeria. In some cities, there were riots uh, yesterday, blockades, ATM machines were attacked. Some banks were touched in the southern part of the country. But calm now has been restored, but people are still upset because there's still limited cash in supply. Banks are not supplying enough cash to people. And Nigeria is basically a cash economy. Very few people have access to internet banking facilities or mobile money transactions. So it's a very difficult situation. I mean, 40% of the population don't have access to bank accounts. So what are they supposed to do? The central bank has said it has deployed agents, especially those in rural areas, to cater to these people who do not have access to financial institutions for them to be able to get access to cash. But the problem is there is still limited cash in supply, even though that some people who went to the banks in the course of the week were given Naira coins to begin to transact business. But the problem is these coins are really heavy and have weak purchasing power. So it's very difficult what people are going through. I personally have not had cash in over two weeks. So it's been very, very difficult. And that's why there have been protests and riots in parts of the country. That's really interesting. Uh, in terms of the decision we've had today, uh, how much do you think that eases the situation? Because it's uh, only a short period where the old notes will, will still be legal tender. Well, Matthew, it is hoped that in the next couple of days, we would begin to see easing um, at the ATM queues and people would access cash less stressfully but the central bank governor just this afternoon announced that he had been in a meeting with some commercial banks earlier in the day following president buhari's directive and he had told them to begin to issue out the old 200 naira notes back in circulation just so people can have access to cash so it's hoped that in a few days that all of this would ease but the problem is next week the supreme court is going to decide on whether the 200 500 and 1,000 Naira old banknotes would still be legal tenders. And that decision is coming just three days to the country's general election. So it's really very confusing at this time. Well, it's clearly one to watch. And Ketchi, thanks very much for bringing us the latest there from Lagos. Thank you.